Good afternoon and welcome to WJZ.com. Starting to cloud up a little bit here, and we're also seeing some sun. That means a couple things. One, cold fronts on the way. Two, that sun's going to help stir up the atmosphere and up our chance of seeing maybe some gusty thunderstorms that much more. Let's go ahead and start off with some temperatures. And basically what I want to show you is a, uh, is a look around the beltway where we're in the upper 50s to low 60s. But if you go out to Western Maryland when that cold front's passed, we're already dropping through the 40s. If you go down to Delmarva, it's actually a little bit warmer. We're going to go for a high temperature today of about 65 degrees. I make this presentation for you. I'm making it for you at 1230. I want to put a timestamp on this. You may be logging in uh, 1 30 quarter to 2. So I want you to see what is headed our way. And that is, once again, frontal boundary. You can see the cloud tops. You can also see uh, the breaks in these clouds. And again, sunshine, thermals rise from the ground. Ground heats up, thermals rise. You start to stir the atmosphere up, and boom, that's where you get that cause and effect. Here's radar at 1230. Uh, and again, this will have changed by the time you log on later. But what I want you to note is instead of seeing just green shower activity moving our way, now we're starting to see a little more vigorous rain mixed in out ahead of the leading edge of that new air mass. So we have a slighter marginal risk for severe weather in the area as we move through the next few hours. I want to point something out. This line between the slight and marginal this morning was right on the west side of the beltway. It's now moved south beyond Washington. So with that little bit of sunshine, as that cold front comes through, we're just amping things up a little bit. Front's going to pass by rather quickly. By 3 o'clock, it's going to be over the eastern shore and heading it south offshore. And then here comes a new air mass into the region. And that's going to change our weather. Temps drop. We have a freeze warning in effect for tonight. Next chance rain is going to be late day Thursday when the low comes up in the Gulf Coast states. And there's another low following in its wake that's going to give us another chance of rain as we move through the weekend. Take a look at where you live. Take a look at the graphic. If you're under the purple, you have a freeze warning in effect 2 a.m. through 8 a.m. this next sleep period. Thunderstorm around 62 your high this day. Overnight tonight, mainly clear colder. 36. It's going to start getting windy, and that breeze slash wind will be with us as we move through tomorrow. 57 degrees is going to be the high. Then there's Thursday's rain, 62. Morning rain Friday. I don't want to promise a lot of sun Friday afternoon. Let's just see how it squares away. Saturday, noon and on, gray skies, damp conditions, 64. Sunday, still some showers around, maybe a few peaks of sun, 62. Monday, same deal, and 60. We are watching the weather very closely out to the west. If need be, we'll provide an update here at WJZ.com. If you follow us on Facebook, we will, if we see conditions warrant, go to a Facebook Live. Thanks so much for stopping by WJZ.com.